Good evening, Mayor. Larry Hanley. I'm the president of the Amalgamated Transit Union here on Staten Island. Mayor, Boss Tweed, when he corrupted this city, one of the things he did is prevent the subway from being built for about 10 or 15 years. You may know that. And he did it because he controlled the franchises to operate stagecoaches in Manhattan. And he got payoffs in exchange for doling them out. Mayor Walker had to resign in shame and disgrace. And the reason he had to resign, among other things, but the main thing that got him out was the fact that he was involved in a corrupt bus franchise deal with a non-existent bus company called the Equitable Bus Company. And he took payoffs for that. And today, in this city, in your administration, a very similar thing is happening. What's happened here in Staten Island over the last decade is that one particular bus company, the Atlantic Express Bus Company, which gets probably more subsidies for all its different businesses from government than any company in town, whether it be school buses or the Department of Motor Vehicles moving into their property. That company has corrupted your administration. Oh, get out of here. Uh, that's mayor? The, the, well, Mayor, no, listen, no, if no, you listen, if you listen to everybody stop, else, then listen to me. Mayor. If you, well, why don't, if, why you if you want to discuss, okay, if, you, if you want to discuss this okay. with me, I'll give you another chance, okay? Uh, uh, thank if you, you want to discuss this with me, okay. well, cut out irresponsible, okay. stupid, so why ridiculous well, charges. Okay, well, why don't I just give you stupid facts? Nobody is why corrupted. Why don't I give you stupid facts? You explain to me facts, okay. I'll respond to it. Otherwise, picture, the conversation's mayor. over. Here's a picture, Mayor. It's a picture of an Atlantic Express bus that is built deliberately to, be, to run in campaigns. On it is your picture, Mr. Mayor. On it is the picture of Borough yeah, President. That Colin is total on ridiculous it, well, nonsense. My ask, picture is on thousands of buses. But, but there's one problem. And I find but people mayor, who make mayor, false mayor, and irresponsible problem. charges oh, of corruption to be reprehensible. Them. Mayor, you won't hear them. That's mayor, the, take the, the microphone away. Mayor, end the of the conversation. Matter. Sorry, Mr. Hanley. That's the end of the conversation. It's the end of the conversation. That is the end of the conversation. I do not talk to people that accuse me of corruption. That's the end of the conversation. If you have another question to ask, we will talk about it. Sit down, and that's the end of your irresponsible charges. You can try that with somebody else. You're not going to try it with me. Let us move on to the next subject. Does someone else have another subject they would like to talk about? That's the end of this conversation. I'm not running away from anything. I'm standing here and you're acting like a bunch of immature idiots. Ask another question. You all look too irresponsible to be bus drivers. Now, ask a question. You accuse me of corruption, I stop talking to you. That's the end of it, okay? You accuse me of committing a crime and corruption. I do not talk to you. So that's the end of the conversation. Next question. You can pull that nonsense with somebody else. Yes. My name is Dee Vandenberg. I'm now the president of the Staten Island Taxpayers Association. Um, my question is to, towards Mr. C Commissioner Carey from the Economic Development Corporation. Our late president, Lorraine Storch, that we lost this year, had put together a plan for a parcel that they refer to as Charleston Retail from Mega Mall in Charleston, not too far from here. We are suffering. cause trouble and you're a bunch of idiots. You came here to cause trouble, you've accomplished it, and you're probably too irresponsible to be handling other people on buses. Question. Thank you. Really, really scary that these people drive buses. I 
I know the kindergarten does a lot better than these morons, but go ahead. You are acting would... like morons. Yes. Yes. Mrs. Sorge, Mrs. Yes. Sorge had spoken with <coughs> Commissioner Carey some time ago in reference to Charleston Retail Center. And don't, don't worry. Don't worry. There are a bunch of bullies. Don't worry about it. Sit down. Go ahead. Commissioner Carey had said he would reach out and sit down with Mrs. Sorge. Unfortunately, that's not possible right now. Staten Island Taxpayers Association is extremely concerned. It's a big parcel of land. It is now slated for yet another mega mall like we need one. And we're suffering on this south shore of this island 